What's going on everyone and welcome back to another episode of Nightmare Culture. In this episode I'm really excited because we got Chucky on Dead by Daylight. Now I haven't played Dead by Daylight in quite a while I'm going to be honest especially on the PC so I had to get the test build just so I could test out Chucky. First off what I want to state is Chucky fits this game to me perfectly. Like for Freddy being in there I've always wanted a Nightmare on Elm Street alone title. I've always wanted a Michael Myers alone title. And obviously we got Tex Chainsaw Massacre. But for some reason to me, Chucky just fits perfect into the Dead by Daylight world. So I wanted to go over a little bit about his perks. The good guy has two separate modes he can switch between, which is normal mode and hidey ho mode. Hidey ho mode lasts for 14 seconds while in this mode the killer has no terror radius and distraction footprints and audios are spawned all across the map. His special attack is Slice and Dice. I don't know why I said it like that. His special ability is Scamper. While in Heidi Ho mode, when you're near a vault or pallet, you can quickly like scammer through it. His perks are two can play. Just this means survivors who stun or blind you are also blinded for 1.5 seconds. That's a pretty good one to have. His next one is batteries included. When within 12 meters of any completed generator, you have a 5% increase in haste. The movement speed bonus lingers for 5 seconds after leaving the generator's range. His last perk is friends till the end. You become obsessed with one survivor. You, when you hook a survivor that is not the obsession, the obsession becomes expanded for 20 seconds and reveals their aura for 10 seconds. When you do hook the obsession, another random survivor screams and reveals their position and becomes the new obsession. That one's a really good perk to have. Due to his short height, the good guy has a fixed third person point of view, which I, I'm going to just stop right there. That is the perfect point of view for Chucky one. You can't do first person point of view. And it also let me see an entire different look of this game. I think now Dead by Daylight needs to let every character have a third person point of view because it just felt so right. I mean, I may be the only one that thinks that, but... It was perfect being third person point of view. Now Chucky or the good guy doll is definitely one of my favorite killers now to use in Dead by Daylight. I'm definitely going to be playing this a lot. Now do I think he's OP? No. A lot of people are probably going to think that right at the beginning. Especially because he has this third person point of view and he can dash pretty fast. But there are some negatives to being Chucky. So I want to know what you guys think. If you're playing the test build, do you love Chucky? If you're not, are you excited for it? And is this definitely one you're going to get? Let me know all that in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe.